So our game is called The Signal. It's about a person who crash lands on an alien planet after getting a distress signal. And so they go searching for the signal through this planet and end up releasing this really bad god thing. Uh, it's one player, it's horror, and it's based off of um, an artist's paintings that are really, really cool. I just kind of randomly stumbled upon this really great artist named, I'm probably going to butcher his name, but it's Zadislav Beksinski. And uh, I just really loved his work and I thought it would be great for making a horror game. So basically, uh, I'm pretty sure it started off with Corey had this idea that he saw the paintings, and so Corey and Harrison were our first two team members. They, they basically said, we're 3D modelers, we want to do a project with a whole bunch of 3D modeling, and after that, we just grabbed uh, one of every other spot that we needed to fill, and that's how our team came. I think the most interesting part of our game is going to be the world that we're trying to create. I wouldn't say there's a lot of gameplay mechanics that will be like uh, anything revolutionary, but we want to create this really interesting world that the player can believe. And with all the three models and the environments that we're trying to create, we're hoping that the player will feel a bit more immersed in it. The biggest challenge for our group is probably using the engine that we decided to put our game in, which is Unreal 4. It's a relatively new engine, and not many of us have had a chance to work with it previously. It was a very inspired idea by our producer, Cade, and a lot of us are uh, overcoming the challenges of not having a lot of uh, reference material to work with or teachers to ask, but the progress we've made has been astounding, to say the least. I think the thing I'm most proud of is how organized and like well to the schedule we're keeping because I don't think anyone here has worked on a game this big before and the fact that we can keep producing all these assets, putting them together on a keeping to the schedule, I think it's pretty awesome. Should we reach a a point at the end of this development cycle where we say we really want to go forward with this and it's something that we find very interesting. Um, our overall plan in about a year and a half from today or so is to find an indie booth at PAX East to, to buy out a spot and have a, a small booth.